What up y'all, welcome back to the kitchen and welcome to the spring. For today's quickie recipe, I'm gonna show you how to turn this amazing artichoke into a delicious kale pesto. It's the perfect combo for a veggie and orzo medley. Check it out. So the first thing we're gonna do is we are going to prep our artichoke. Now we need the artichoke hearts. So if you've never worked the artichoke before, it's really simple. You're gonna take out some scissors, cut off the leaves, just like this. Then you're gonna take the sharpest knife in your kitchen, cut right here. But you see, it's just beautiful inside. This is the part that we have to remove. It is not edible. All right, so now I'm just shaving off the other part. Okay, now we're just gonna repeat that process for all of these. Ooh, and then we're gonna whoa, steam whoa, 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 whoa. them. Cap, 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 cap. <laughs> they, make, they make these in cans. It's supposed to be a cookie recipe, man. <laughs> okay. I use can because this is a quickie recipe. Here are some artichoke hearts. They've been brined because they were in the can, but you can also buy these frozen. This is gonna be our quick swap for today. Let's prep the rest of our veggies. Some zucchini. Yellow squash. Some red bell pepper, another pop of color. And lastly, some red onion. Drizzle of olive oil, sea salt, and some cracked pepper. Give them a nice toss. We want these veggies crisp tender, so we're only gonna roast them for about 12 to 15 minutes at 420. You can also air fry them or put them in a convection oven for eight to 10 minutes at 400. What are you gonna do? <laughs> we're gonna, we're thinking about starting up at Esmore, um, you know, I feel like if you say Asmar, it makes it, it sound like it's better. you're about 50 years old or something like that. It is Asmar. You know, people just say ASMR. They do? I think they do. Okay. <laughs> hey, y'all. Hey, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. This is the mic. This is the mic. Push the phone. Right here. Hey, don't worry about it. Thank you so much for the likes. Thank you. I'm here with my today. That's what they do. Hold on. Let me, just, let me just chop and sell. <laughs> That's what the guy was doing on TikTok. <laughs> now let's make our artichoke pesto. Take a couple of our artichoke hearts, add those right in here. Got some kale here. Strip it, put it on down in there. Our basil, man I love basil. You can also use cilantro if you'd like. Walnuts, and then some freshly squeezed lemon. A little bit of Parmesan. We are gonna add some fresh black pepper. To get it started, just a little bit of drizzle of olive oil off the top. Oh, next we're gonna add a little bit of protein to this. We're gonna use some chicken. Fire up our skillet. We're gonna add in a little bit of olive oil. And then into the pot goes the chicken. And as it cooks, we're gonna add in a pinch of sea salt and some black pepper. Once we get a nice color on the chicken and it's cooked through, take it out with some tongs and set it aside. Gonna reduce the heat here in the skillet to about a medium. Then I'm gonna add in some Campari tomatoes. Also gonna add in the orzo. We're gonna toast the orzo. I'm gonna add in some garlic too. Orzo is nice and toasted. You see it trains in colors a little bit. Now, in goes the water. That's good. I'm just gonna cover this up, let those tomatoes soften. Boom. Check on the orzo. Beautiful. And then now with the tomatoes, just gonna smash them. Add in our spring vegetables. Add in the chicken now. Gonna be even elevated now with our spring artichoke pesto. And there you have it. A delicious, ready for the spring, artichoke pesto. Ha, ha, ha.